honestly, the thing that sticks with me is coming out of the backyard and just turning left down the high street and you see the whole crowd there. That, that really does hit you then that while wow, this is happening, even as I'm speaking now, you can, I can feel the hair standing up. And that, that really did hit me. And as you get closer to the stage, you can see your family. Ah, it's special. and the other fear and common riding held the day after the summer of long beer on the 27th day in July annually. Gentlemen, the first thing that I'm going to acquaint you with are the names of the portioners' grants of honour and from whence their services are from. Now, gentlemen, we're gone from the tune and first of all, the Kel Greenville Garden Road. It is an ancient place where play is got, and it belongs to us by right and left. And then from there, the long one will go through, where every yin fair Britain's cut and bow. Then last of all, we to the most to steer. The side of our marches, very clear. And when unto the castle crags we come, I'll cry the on a bear, and then we'll beat the drum. Now, gentlemen, what you've heard this day concerning gun and runner marches, it is expected that every night we have occasions for beats. Reckons, flocks, steeds are play. Shall go with this day in defense of our property, and they shall hear the proclamation of the land fair upon the castle craigs. Everybody in the tunes like that, the kind where they'll be, the kind where they can, they'll be standing in the same spot as they have been for years. They'll go in and watch the, the, the gallop of the curb going at the same spot. It's all like, I've been. Just to see him going to gallop into the hill in that manner, you know, it really, really meant it. He was going so fast he had to like lean the flag away forward because it's quite, it's quite a heavy flag with, with, the, with the size of it and the cloth and stuff. And he was going as if, as if he was charging into battle. His head, he was looking straight ahead like that, and I thought that is so, it was just perfect in every way. I remember standing on Kirkwine when it was we coming in day, and a horse came flying up past me. It was, it was opposite where Paul Beatty's plant is on Kirkwine, and got a big shock, I absolutely crapped. <laughs> It's the sound and it's the way that you can feel the ho you can feel the horses gallop at the current point. You, you could stand with your eyes closed and know exactly what was going on because it goes through your feet and it kind of just sits right in your chest and it just oh, it makes us all agree. You know, yeah, I, I was not even slightly nervous before I did it because I just I, I was I was confident that it was going to go well and I had a really good horse and it like it went up really quickly and it felt like everything I'd ever dreamed it would be, and better. It was so thrilling. And I can remember hearing the crowds, and, you know, but I was looking straight ahead of me, I never saw a single soul. Although I could hear the noise, I never saw a single soul. And it was, it was when I got to the top, you know, up onto the hill, I was so emotional having done it. Luckily I was at the front, so nobody could see me. But that, that without a doubt, was mine. By a long, long, long way the most thrilling thing that ever happened to me at the common ring. I'm sure the fairs cried all over the world. There'll be people that'll just, they'll know it's the last Friday in July, wherever they are. There's photographs of me, knee high to a grasshopper, trussed up in dresses, carrying Heather Bisms, and looking really delighted. It's the big one, it's when folk like, their houses are full, folks are sleeping on sofa beds, bought mattresses, cushions on the floor, and it brings everybody in. It's great.
each thing like that, each emblem, symbol, it all has a, a deep meaning. Some of them's lost in, in time, but the, the, the fact that they still preserve that. I like the Barbary, where they come down the, the, the north part of Drove Road and, and back onto the, the, the main road, because it's such a, con you know, the band's making a lot of noise, you can see the horses, you can see the band, you can see the people, all compacted in a really small area. One of the great things about the common riding is that it doesn't matter who you are, what your rank is or who you are in the town, no one will ever see it all. So little families have little traditions and big families have big traditions and it means the same to every single one and wherever if somebody sneaks away to, to just for five minutes just to see a certain little ceremony happen or another thing happen here or there, it, I think that's the brilliant thing about it, that nobody can claim it for their own, it belongs to everyone. I think for people who know Langham people who don't quite understand Langham, coming to Common Ride and answers the majority of the questions that they have. The history of this area, because it's it's been a buffer zone between Edinburgh and London for centuries, millennia, it, whether they realise it or not, it, it's ingrained in the people right across the border. So that sense of community for your own community and neighbouring communities and the support for each other, it's, it's, I've never experienced it anywhere else. Well, I think that the, the old better felt than telt is, a, is a, good, a good phrase in a situation like that, but to describe it in one sentence, from my point of view, it's, it's tradition going back hundreds of years that is still celebrated in a very big way. And it brings a community together in a, in a remarkable way where everyone's energies are channeled towards the same thing, and that is, let's celebrate what common right, let's celebrate what we've got here, and we, we realise just how lucky we are. And that is the, the overall emotion that, that generates the, the local passion and the, the local feeling for it. How would I describe it in one sentence? It's a day for people, it's a day for tradition, it's a day of great cultural and historical significance, and it's just great fun. It's at the heart of everyone, isn't it? And as an incomer, incomer into the town, for me, I know what I feel about it. <laughs> put it into words without getting emotional, it's very, very difficult. For someone that's been brought up with it as a child for generations and generations, my stomach's doing somersaults talking about it, so how do they feel? It's just, it's indescribable. Better, with better men than me with a pen I've tried and failed, but it's just, it's difficult. Yeah, common ride has been everything. Because it's ours. This, like, nobody else has what we have. Just the, the day that Langham people measure their year upon. If they have had a good common ride, they've had a good year. When you, when you wake up on common ride day, Langham looks as if it's been given a spring clean, it just looks different. And I know there's, there's bunting up and a lot of people going about, but there's something about the town that looks different. Now, gentlemen, what you've heard this day concerning Gun and Runner Merchies, it is expected that every inn who has occasion for beets, brickens, flax, steens, or clay shall go out this day in defence of their property, and they shall hear the proclamation of the Langham Fair upon the Castle Craigs. Yeah. <laughs> I, I had a go what we'll do. You know, it, it, not standing in a normal place, not to be 
Yeah, same same people, same places will be very it'll be really peculiar. I, I mean, I hinna I hinna give it enough a lot of thought what we'll do because because I'm, I'm just okay, I just I really have no idea. It'll be, it's going to be very peculiar. It's just, it's, it's absolutely heartbreaking for us not to have a corner. Absolutely heartbreaking. It breaks my bloody heart. Oh, it's so hard. But what can't be beat? It's it's like it honestly it's like there's there's this this extra person who should be here this week drumming up this big palaver and this big song and dance and having a great time and they're just not there and you're like oh it, it feels like grief it's just like a massive loss to the talent to everybody involved and it uh, it's just it's sad it's very sad that we've had to do this but uh, you know. I think people's health is way more important than trying to, you know, it never ever occurred to us to do anything other than what we're doing. They won't be put down, they, they just won't, they will do what they do. So now, I'll awaw him, and he'll barley bunner, and I'll sat herring to me dinner, be the way I'll style! Yay! It is Langham. That's about it, like, there's... If you want to understand Langham, you have to come to Common Riding. When Common Riding comes around next year, it'll be bigger and better. There's a return on the border, that I had to long to see.